Elliot in Atlanta writes to me, Hey Paul, I have come out of my computer with USB to a DAC, okay, then RCA out to RCA into the headphone amp. My headphones plug in the amp with a quarter inch jack, so everything is single ended. My question is, is there an advantage to using a balanced XLR out of the DAC to balanced XLR into the headphone amp and then a headphone cable with a four prong XLR balanced end? My system is quiet now and I have plenty of volume, but many people seem to value a balanced arrangement. Thanks for your answer. Yeah, I am one of those people who value quite highly balanced arrangements. Not so much to your headphone. If it were me, I would have the balanced output of my DAC going balanced into a balanced input headphone amplifier. And from there, I don't see any advantage to using a balanced cable going to your headphones, okay? So let's discuss why. First off, balanced, when they're electrically balanced, we know that that means coming out of our DAC, we're going to have a signal that has two phases, ground and two phases. We're normally in a single-ended RCA, we have ground and one phase. And by phase, I mean one signal wire and one ground wire. Now when we go balanced, we're gonna have one ground wire and two signal wires. One is going up while the other is going down. And between the two, we get the signal as opposed to single-ended. Now the advantage of that is if you buy a properly designed headphone amplifier on its input, it'll have a balanced input that uses what we call common mode rejection that eliminates noise and distortion inside of the amplifier. So anything that is not common to the, um, anything that is common to those two signals will be eliminated. Only the differences between the two will be amplified. And so that's always a better way to go. You get a hotter signal, cleaner, lower noise, and typically lower distortion, and overall better sound. The headphones themselves don't really take advantage of that because there's nothing at the end of that to put them together and get this common mode benefit. So I wouldn't focus too much on that, but certainly on the input to the headphone amplifier. All right, thanks for the question. Good luck. Let me know how it goes. All right, bye.